hello lovely people welcome back to my channel or hello if you're new thank you so so much for being here i am tired this week but this week is packing launch orders essentially i'm not sure how much i'll share packing wise on the vlog because I am planning on doing a separate packing video because I haven't done one of those in a while. It's very rare that I kind of have a kind of more than five orders to pack at one go in one time. And also if I do have five, they're often very, very similar orders. And when I film the packing videos, I kind of like them to be a little bit different for each order that I'm packing up and just, it just makes it a bit more exciting for those watching and also gets to show off my product range a little bit better because obviously if I was packing up five orders for the same enamel pin people are going to assume that I only sell these enamel pins and it's just not the best content so I'm thinking of filming a separate video this week um, of course I will share a few of the orders on here I am thinking I'll save a few for an Instagram live as well because I have 32 to pack which is incredible it has been a long time since i've had that many to pack um so thank you so much if you've supported the shop update in any way i am so grateful i really did not expect the response that we had for the 28 days of sunshine launch if you aren't sure what i'm on about i've said it quite a few times in these vlogs but i've had a few new people join me um from the last two vlogs that i've posted so hello thank you for being here i hosted a drawing challenge on instagram in february it was called 28 days of sunshine and and this came out of it, the colouring book. So there were 28 different prompts and each prompt, like I drew an illustration for, so many other people got involved and it was just such an amazing and creative month. I just had to bring a collection from it and this was the star of the show my coloring book if you watched last week's vlog you would have seen me unbox this and how excited i was i have colored one triangle here <laughs> but i've just been a little bit too busy to to sit down and do it properly but i'll have time for that once all the orders are out of the way and things all 28 illustrations in here in kind of line art form so you can color them in the paper's a really lovely quality and at the back we also have a like an interactive page so this is a what brings you sunshine and draw something you love and then you can share it to the hashtag that we used for the drawing challenge so um these are available if you wanted to go and have a look they are really lovely if i do say so myself so yeah this week is all about packing up orders i'm feeling a little bit overwhelmed but I'm gonna take it in stages. Yesterday I made lots of stickers. I think I filmed a bit of footage, so that will be before this. I have made a lot of stickers and I've just realized I still need to make more because I offered a freebie and I haven't made those yet. Um, so we have a huge <laughs> pile of stickers. Not all of these are going out in orders, but a lot of them are. So I'm very excited about that. And yeah, I'm, I'm excited to get them all out. The only issue that I kind of there's always something when you do a shop update that goes wrong and for me it was one the acrylic keychains the files took forever to kind of get right um, it was a lot of back and forth with the manufacturer but they did come perfectly so I suppose that's not so bad but I completely forgot that the raw mail shipping prices went up yesterday so all of my parcels are gonna cost 10 15 P if not more than they were going to and I hadn't adjusted my prices in accordance to that thankfully I think a lot of the orders are covered in the sense of the amount of items that they've ordered and then it ups their weight and then that puts it into the next kind of bracket so I think we're okay in that sense but I'm just going to get them sent out I'm going to I've already adjusted my uh, shipping prices a little bit I'm going to sit down and look at it properly and make sure that it's definitely right but i want to get all these orders out of the way first but yeah there's always something and for me it was the shipping this time which is a bit of a bum but i didn't think about it um and then also because it's easter weekend um this friday there's likely to be a delay with orders um <laughs> so i'm gonna do my best to get as many as i can out today i'm gonna do my best i'm gonna do my absolute best so yeah i'm not sure how much i'll share on here but hopefully i'll be jumping in and out um through the week but yeah i just wanted to say thank you so much for all the love on the shop update i really really didn't expect it and it just feels so good to do something i love and to have other people love it too i really can't explain how good that feels especially at a time of family grief and like having something to focus on that's making me feel so good is 
exactly what I need right now so thank you so much for just supporting me always and leaving me lovely comments and just being so lovely um yeah I am gonna get on with it now because it is already gone 11 a.m so I kind of want to get started because I'm on a little bit of a go slow because I'm tired as I said so yeah I've got cut logo stickers because I don't have any of those I need to cut out the freebies and then I will start packing um so yeah thank you so much I lied, I am gonna share something with you because I ordered from the lovely Gemma at Birdsey Belazair. I will leave Gemma's links down below. Gemma makes candles and lovely, lovely things. And recently she came out with skincare, which is so exciting. And I saw, I'm just trying to find it in the box. She had a face mask and the cool thing about these face masks is they're not your typical face mask. This is a pink clay face mask bar. So essentially it's a bar of soap, um, but it's a face mask soap. So you get it wet and then it forms the face mask and you can put it on from there. But it means that you can get so many uses out of this and you don't have to open a whole packet to then use what you want. I know you can get like tubs and things, but this is like there's no plastic, there's no like pots and things that you'll have to throw away after like it literally will just keep going until it's gone and i think that's great so it's just packaged in like eco friend i can't remember the type of paper this is but it's like an eco-friendly paper natural vegan palm free and handmade so i'm really excited to try this it smells really clean and really kind of earthy which i love Gemma also did a really lovely and generous kind of deal when you ordered for every three orders there was a free gift for everybody so i think she ended up with something like 18 orders so that's three six nine twelve fifteen eight that's like six free gifts for every single person and Gemma has been so so generous like i actually can't believe the love that's gone into these parcels and the kindness um i'm just gonna check i haven't missed anything from the packing peanuts which are yellow Gemma knows me too well. I'm sure this is just the colour of her peanuts, but I've just pulled everything out. But we've got a whole bunch of free goodies, which is insane. The first thing is this candle, which is the Paradise Self Care Collection candle. And I was very excited when I got this because I have a little tea light on my. I can never point when I'm behind. On my drawers over here, the rainbow drawers, I got some tea lights when I ordered the Shoreline candle from Gemma a few months ago. And I always smell it because it smells amazing. And I got it in this one, which is just so good. I got Aaron to smell it, my husband, yesterday. And he was like, oh my gosh, it smells like a beach. And I was like, that is exactly what Gemma was going for. It smells like a sandy beach in the sunshine. It's just beautiful. It smells incredible. We also got two wax melts. So this is the Forbidden Fruit Soy Coconut Wax Melts. And also the rest one, which is lavender. I can't pronounce this very well. Lang Lang. Yang Lang. I'm sure you know what I mean. And chamomile. Chamomile. One of those. We also have some goodies from Gemma's other business, which is Wish Art Studios. We have a really pretty speckled pocket mirror, a collection of, ooh, <laughs> why is that floppy like that? <laughs> a collection of stickers and a little supporting dreams badge, which I love. And then we have some paper goods. Thank you for being such a blessing in my life. This is a card from WS Crafts Creations. We also have that speckled design in a beautiful notebook. Goals and inner potential uh, like planner thing, which is really cool. So yeah, thank you so much, Gemma. You are unbelievably generous and I can't wait to, to use the wax melts and burn the candles and obviously use the face mask because as you can see, my skin is just not right at the moment. I'm really excited to use that. But now I am gonna get into orders because I've been chatting for ages. And I probably could have got a couple of orders done by now, so let's go.
Okay, so I've laid everything out on here so that I can just grab it when I pack each order. I do need to sort all of this. Like, it's very organised chaos. I mean, it maybe it's not that much of a chaos, actually. But I've had to start stacking some boxes on top of each other. These are, like, my enamel pins and things. I still need to peel all these charms. But I don't think that many were ordered. So I'm not going to worry about that just yet. I've got my bookmarks here. These little tubs are from Dunelm, I believe. But I think you can get them in loads of places now. Then we've got the key rings, the prints, which um, are all in kind of... Those top ones aren't organised, but the rest are. And then the stationery. The top ones have the banners on, but I still need to do more of those. So yeah, still a bit of prep to do, but I'm going to get started on orders. And then, yeah, I'll feel a little bit better once I've started, I think. I don't know how well you can hear that but there are people strimming outside and mowing and that's great right as I sat down to actually pack orders on the vlog I can still do that but we're not gonna have the nice little tissue paper noises and all the stuff that I know some of you love like it's a little bit annoying but I'll add in some footage packing some orders in a minute but yeah it just won't have any sound but i'll put some nice music over it and things and then if you love the packing order segments i will start filming some orders later on um so maybe i'll get a good chunk done today this morning this afternoon and then i'll pack for the video later on because there's no way that i'm going to get all these orders done in a couple of hours it's going to take me all day if i do it to all today um so yeah i'm really sorry that there's not going to be <laughs> The nice kind of packing noises in the vlog but that is just not a noise you want in the background it's not very nice it's not nice to listen to here let alone through camera so yeah anyway i'll chat to you in a bit just dropped a whole box of pencils on the floor <laughs> oh they were all 
nicely ranged. <laughs> Look, they're all on the floor. <laughs> oh my gosh. That is just so annoying. All three trays. Oh well, it's happened. There's nothing I can do about that. So please excuse my slightly crazy look. I haven't had my hair up since I've had it cut and I'm feeling a little bit odd with it because it's so short, there's like not much to it. And then I also keep getting like a pineapple at the top. But anyway, that's not what I came on to talk about. I came on because I got a really lovely card in the post this morning, a birthday card from Katura. It's just so lovely. It really warmed my heart when I opened it this morning. And it came on this beautiful card, which is available on their shop, I believe. The links will be down below. And then I got a little bundle of stickers, which I'm going to have a look at in a minute. But thank you so much. I. It's just amazing that sharing my journey can, like, connect me with so many wonderful and kind people. It just blows my mind. And this is all the way from Kansas as well. So it's just so lovely. Thank you so much. And I also thought it would be nice to share with you a treat that I bought myself. It took a bit of convincing from my husband for me to actually do it because I just love putting money back into the business <laughs> and it's not very often that I get something like nicer to treat myself with. Obviously I support small businesses and things with the money that I earn through the shop but this was a bigger kind of present to myself for how much I achieved in February and March. Like I need to celebrate that you know like i have worked really hard and yes i'm exhausted but it's been incredible the last couple of months so i bought myself a little bag from fable fable england is that their name and they do the most beautiful bags and things so i'm gonna open it up because when i saw this i just couldn't stop thinking about it let me pull this Okay, I thought that was going to be much more satisfying than it was. <laughs> okay, it's in here. Everyone has a story. What's yours? <laughs> it's even more beautiful than I thought it was going to be. This is the back. <laughs> oh my gosh, are you ready? Because I don't think you're ready. I mean, maybe it's not to everyone's taste, but oh my gosh, it's beautiful. I'm gonna, okay. <laughs> Look at this. It is a little sleeping door. Is it a dormouse? I think it's a dormouse. I'm not sure it says on here, but I think it's the a, a sleeping uh, dormouse and it's all embroidered. I don't know how well you can see this. Let's try and focus on it. It's an embroidered bag. So yeah. Oh, this is beautiful and it's the perfect size. I did have to check what the measurements were because I was really worried it wouldn't fit my phone, but it does just, <laughs> um, which means it will fit everything that I need in there. Um, and yeah, that was, that was my little treat to myself. Um, I just thought it'd be nice to share on here. It's beautiful. I love it so much. Um, so yeah, thank you for allowing things like this to happen and thank you to my husband for actually encouraging me to do it. Okay, so now I'm gonna get back to orders. I'm gonna go on an Instagram live and share packing those orders um, and then I'm gonna get them all labeled up to ship. If you are waiting for an order, by the time this video goes out, they will all be in the system, um, but because of Easter, there are gonna be two days that Royal Mail aren't working, so things might take a little bit longer. I'll chat to you in a bit. <laughs> It is incredibly bright here. I don't think it's that bright on the camera, but looking out the window, it's very bright. But oh, let me just show you because I feel so proud of myself. I'm just about able to hold them all. <laughs> just about without dropping them. 33 orders done, packed, ready to go. Oh gosh, not sure that was my best idea in the world. There we go. Orders are done. I feel really good to have them all done and just, yeah, so proud of myself, like I said before. So yeah, I'm now gonna go have a chill, sort them into piles to go to the post box. I'm gonna get the international ones sent out first. Just thank you so much, I'm so grateful. I'm not 100% sure what I'm gonna be sharing with you for the rest of the week. I need to kind of get my brain out of packing order mode before I can think about the next thing. So yeah, I'll chat to you in a bit, but I just wanted to say a massive thank you. So we've made it to Friday. I 
didn't pick up the camera yesterday I just needed a little bit of a switch off and I've been kind of feeling like that today so yeah I just thought rather than stressing about what I could be sharing with you I I'm just gonna take some time to kind of reset and work out what my next plans are so I know I filmed an extra video which I had planned on sharing next week as well as this studio vlog but what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna use the packing video in place of a studio vlog for next week I just need a week to reset and rethink about what I'm doing next I do know that I want to start working towards or like so more solidly planning a patreon um that won't be again for another few months but I kind of want to really start putting like getting the ideas going and writing down some ideas of things that I'd like to offer and just kind of sit on that for a bit and the other thing is washi tape and I have got some designs that I really love so that's another thing that I'm going to be working on but in regards to sharing behind the scenes on the studio vlogs I just don't have that much to show you right now there is this weird thing when you do like a like a, a shop update or at least for me there is I have this kind of slightly low period after because it's like such a high for ages working on new things and packing orders and all that kind of stuff and then it kind of stops and I have to kind of yeah reset essentially so that's going to be my plan next week i hope that's good with you all i just need to take that time away to be providing the best content that i can rather than me sitting here saying i don't know what i'm doing i don't know what i'm doing um it's not very not very good content not very fun to watch so yeah that's what i'm gonna do but before i head off i have some more happy mail from the wonderful Clara OK Doodle and I ordered some smiley things. I ordered some smiley washi tape. It's just really colourful smiley faces and I just think this is such a simple yet such a nice washi tape and I'm gonna like pop it on my orders and things so I'm really really excited about that. Let me pop it open actually. So it's literally just a repeated pattern of smileys and it's just so cute i knew i had to have it when i saw it because i love the smiley faces i also bought this little like jotter pad like little mini memo pad and it says embrace the moments of joy again with the little smiley faces are they the same oh no so they, these ones have little expressions so these these are smiley faces and then this one's got lots of different expressions on it i love that <laughs> again really good for just writing little notes or little reminders and things and then we've also got a little freebie sticker that says um take a deep breath um and it says thank you for supporting my small biz and also the business card which oh it's all shiny <laughs> yeah so yeah i'm gonna call that the end of the studio vlog thank you so so much for watching and for again all your support i'm really really grateful i just wish i had more to be sharing with you right now but i'll chat to you soon not next week there will be a video next week though um but yeah i'll speak to you very soon